Wednesday. <gasps> it's Wednesday once again. I know. Always pops up yeah. so quickly. Our tablet's <laughs> having a little bit of a wiggle, so hopefully... It's because it died and it's on a charger. Uh, oh, it's settled so down. It's, okay. <laughs> it's heavier on one end yeah. than on the other. It's balanced itself now. I was just like, hopefully for everyone watching, you didn't get like motion sick in the first 30 seconds. Okay, so we are doing um, soft metal. Has some gorgeous Tonight. colors. I'm excited. Um, I also love so, the lip color because it's like one of my go-tos. Because it's dark. Mm -hmm. It's a dark berry. Those are my faves. Mm -hmm. uh, smoky quartz, granite, cinnabar, and crystalline. Mm -hmm. So uh, we are going to substitute crystalline. Well, we do have one there if you want to use okay. it. Okay. But um, sometimes we sub just because crystalline can be really light. Crystalline is shimmery. So I'll show it to you. We'll start with it and I'll mm -hmm. show it to you. And then you can you let us end up deciding we want to do biscotti and something instead. else on top. We'll let you know. You can let us know what you think. Okay. Yeah. So I know I was going to just straight sub and then I was like, oh, there's one in my demo pile. We'll just use okay. it up. So why I'm not a huge fan of crystalline is it is a compared um, to our usual neutral. Yeah. So crystalline has a shimmer in it, which is fine. But it has like a white shimmer. Yeah. Like it's and so quite it can white. sometimes when you're using it up top here, it can look a little chalky. Yeah. And so that's sometimes why I will stay away from it. It's I'll not a great choice for flash photography, especially yes. flash photography in the night. Yeah. Um, but if it's just like a day-to-day -day look and there's no bright yeah. lights or flash, mm -hmm. then you're fine. But so we tend I'm to just kind it. of do a matte just then we just don't have to think about it. Mm -hmm. We're all about the ease of application. And looking good. Yes. Well, and then not having to have 12 different colors, right? Mm -hmm. So, like a biscotti Works or... With everything. Oh, yeah. What's the other one? Candlelight? Blossom. Blossom. That's it. Yeah. Um, those are fantastic options. And then you don't have to be like, oh, what am I doing today? Am I worried about having too much shimmer up top? Yeah. So, that's kind of with that. Now, I will say, crystalline is fantastic if you are doing a smoky eye or a mm, darker it look, it is really nice. For I that. love doing it just on the yeah. inside because it will add, it does add that contrast. Yeah, it yeah. adds brightness to the eyes, and yeah. also if you do tend to get shadowing around yeah. um, the insides of your eyes, put under it's eye corrector, so kind of it's not too bad. It's think. kind of a nice option that way. So, mm -hmm. just so you know, as a highlight, it does have a shimmer in it, so it can look chalky depending on your lighting. Yeah, so there you go. That's your tip of the day. Mm -hmm. Okay, now. But yeah, it does. If for on contrast reasons, to... it's really nice. I'll take my bags. Well, I mean, I put under eye corrector on to cover the bags <laughs> under my eyes, but I'm like, they're looking pretty decent. But light diffusers are a great thing. <gasps> oh, under eye correctors are your best friend. Okay, it so is. now, so I did crystalline all the way to the natural crease. So now I'm doing smoky quartz. All over the lid now smoky quartz is very light it's kind of a deceptive color because when you buy it and see it in your compact you're going to think it's darker than it is but because of the high shimmer in this product it goes on lighter mm -hmm. than it actually looks in the compact because okay so this is the color in the compact so you're um, like, oh yeah, like that's yeah. kind of, you know, it's, I mean, honestly, it's name is pretty darn descriptive. But look at the difference, like the, the shade difference between the crystalline and the, and the smoky quartz isn't huge. No. So it is just a high shimmer. I wouldn't use it as a highlight, but it is a, a really great dark. base. It is. Um, if you want to do uh, a darker color. And have that underneath and then have the shimmer kind of come through. Or if you have a darker color and you just want to add a little pop of light, mm -hmm. it's perfect for that. So I love, I do love smoky quartz. Me too. So now I'm adding granite and I'm adding granite. I'm just going to smudge it kind of in the center, if that makes sense. So granite 
<laughs> is kind of like a middle of the eye massage. It is. <laughs> I'm like, go. oh, she's doing it in the center because I just feel the brush going over the center. I'm like, right. Oh. So I'm just adding it in there just to kind of darken the look because this look has four eyeshadow colors. So yes, I'm adding cinnabar. So I wanted space for cinnabar, if that makes sense. So I wanted to I leave. Really so big. I wanted to leave a space and I didn't want it to get muddy. <laughs> so now I'm doing my cinnabar on the outside edge and then I'm going to smudge this also into the granite. So what I'm basically doing is we've got four colors and I'm kind of just blending them all together. So I'm not doing really strong starts and finishes. And when you've got colors that are very really similar, like honestly, crystalline, smoky quartz and granite are all shimmers. Mm -hmm. So they blend really, really well together. Yeah. And then our only matte color is our um, cinnabar, which we're just doing on the end. So what I'm doing is um, kind of like an inverted V on the corners. Uh, just to kind of intensify and I'm just gonna get you to look up for a sec I'm just gonna add a little bit of smudgy color underneath just to kind of um, pull it all together but it's just sort of it's kind of a soft mm -hmm. look you can if you want to dress this up you can you could throw a thin black eyeliner with that and it mm -hmm. would look fantastic mm -hmm. So, yeah, so if you have like a couple shimmer colors and they're similar to each other, uh, you can just kind of blend them, not all together at the same time. Yeah, but not sort of... all on the top of another because right. then you end up with mud. Kind of, yeah, I was going to say mud. I'm trying to think of a nice way. But mud <laughs> is pretty much the nicest way. I've done that sometimes in the morning. I'm like, I'm going to be all creative with my eyeshadow today and I'm going to try these you know, five colors and they'll be great and I'll blend it and I'll look, you know, so artistic and then I'll do that and it'll look like, you know, makeup mud. mud. Yeah. And or like an accidental bruise. Yeah. You're like, oh, and that color I'll, didn't go well together. Yeah. And then I'll start over and be like, okay, stick to three colors and yeah. you're doing good. Okay. So of course, contour highlight, can't leave home without it. <laughs> <laughs> we think. Um, okay, because we're doing dark lips, um, we're doing dark blush too. So our blush is a wine berry, which is perfect for winter. Mm -hmm. So circles. So now, um, we can now finish it off with a really, is this our color? Yep. Okay. And it's mine, so I don't need to worry about yeah. having it. <laughs> From Jules's personal collection. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, so when you do a darker lipstick, it is good to make sure that you are balancing your blush, especially within that color family. And dark lipsticks are great because it really brings out your eyes. Isn't that mm -hmm. crazy? Because yeah. it goes in your lips. <laughs> but it brings out your eyes. Mm -hmm. So. It's fun. Um, yeah. So our look, again, called Soft, Soft Metals. Metal. And our eyeshadow colors were Smoky Quartz, Granite, Cinnabar, Crystalline. And then we did Contour Highlight, Wine, wine Berry, and then Crushed Berry from mm -hmm. the gel. Semi -shine. semi shine. Okay, I was like, I know it's the gel. I'm like, is it semi shine or the matte? I can't remember. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So that's our look tonight. Mm -hmm. Thanks for joining us. Please comment below. We love yeah. to hear from you. Okay. okay. Have a great day. Bye.